There's a $15,000 reward being offered for information leading to an arrest in connection with the shooting deaths of more than a dozen horses in Floyd County. Today, investigators were out on the scene gathering more evidence, and we want to warn you the details and images in this story are disturbing. Sophia Millar has the LEX 18 big story at 530. Officials searching for clues. It's a needle in a haystack. It's, it's going to come down to the people. Any clues that might lead them to the person who killed at least 13 horses in eastern Kentucky. Hopefully we can get a, a, a caliber of the bullet that was used. A family found the dead horses near an abandoned strip mine in Floyd County, several of which were pregnant. At least five belonged to the family that found them. Every time I spoke with them, you know, they've cried. It's more than a pet to them, you know, it's, it's something they've, they've raised. Uh, uh, every horse uh, to uh, the owners had names. The remaining horses are thought to have been abandoned there over the years. Officials believe the horses were shot on December 8th, but they weren't found for at least another week on the 16th. Tanya Khan says it's unlike anything she's seen before. Well, I've seen a lot of cruelty cases, a lot of neglect cases and starvation cases, and you know that the horses have suffered a longer time, but there's nothing as horrific as the scene that we have saw. What makes the case challenging is the location. There's just so many access points to this, uh, not, include, in, not including the logging roads or roads that these people have made themselves. The abandoned strip mine has countless roads leading up to it, and it's well known for being a place people visit. Numerous people go through here uh, on this property with, with side-by-sides, ATVs. Uh, so at, at this time, it's hard to even speculate what or how many people would be involved in it. Plus, times against their side. We're not left with a lot of uh, physical evidence per se, we're just left with a lot of carnage. For now, they're relying on anonymous tips, hoping the right one comes in. This wasn't an act, in my opinion, of one person. Someone will talk. Someone's bragged about it. Someone will talk. In Floyd County, Sophia Millar, LEX 18 News. Deputies say when arrested, those responsible will face charges including criminal mischief and animal cruelty.